Good Thursday morning. We're headed home to Texas. Joshua 23, 14. And now I am about to go the way of all the earth. And you know in your hearts and souls, all of you, that not one word has failed of all the good things that the Lord your God promised concerning you. All have come to pass for you. Not one of them has failed. The Bible records two kinds of promises from the Lord, unconditional and conditional. An unconditional pledge is one whose fulfillment rests solely with God. His commitment is independent of people and situations. An example would be his covenant never to send another flood to destroy the entire earth. No matter how the world behaves, God will not take that action again. The second type of divine promise is conditional. In other words, the Lord's willing to act under certain circumstances. It's often written in scripture as an if-then statement, and it involves our cooperation. While God's love is always unconditional, His promises on occasion have conditions. But if we do our part, God will always do His part. Romans 10.9 is a prime example. If you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart God raised Him from the dead, you will be saved. Salvation is promised to those who confess with their mouth and believe in their heart that Jesus is Lord. We are saved when we genuinely trust in the Savior. If we come to the Lord with sincere confession of sin, we have the assurance of divine forgiveness and cleansing. The Lord's fulfillment of this vow, it depends on our obedient action. God will do exactly what He promised, but He requires our obedient cooperation before fulfilling His conditional promises. To receive the blessing, we must satisfy the condition. If you are waiting for the Lord to fulfill His promise, check to be sure that you're carrying out your part. Heavenly Father, thank you for Jesus. Thank you for your word and thank you that you are a God who keeps his promises. Not one of your precious promises will fail. Thank you for the lessons that are contained in the pages of scripture. Lord, I trust you to keep all that you have promised to do and I covenant with you to do my part. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' holy name I pray, amen. God bless you. See you tomorrow.